Well hello beautiful people welcome to my channel my name is Teresa and I will be your cruise director on the magical mystery tour today. Um what are we doing? Morphe have these have been out for a while have these $11 palettes called ready in five they have a whole range we're going to do an eye look with one of these uh, palettes today so before we get to it don't forget to subscribe to my channel ring the notification bell to be alerted to any new uploads and if you like this video at the end please give it a big thumbs up doing those things really helps with the growth of my channel so please do that for me I'll be really really happy with it so let's get to it my loves okay as I said these are $11 you can get them from the Morphe site or you can get them from Mecca now Morphe had a bit of a decline over the last few years they haven't been as big as what they used to be back in that massive influencer led era uh, when Jeffree Star and James Charles and Jaclyn Hill were the superstars of the game so but I think they're sort of pairing back I was really worried thought that, that maybe they would end up disappearing by the end of this year but they might be having a comeback their light form um, foundation is beautiful it does pull yellow just as a heads up I have uh, I think the shade 3 and it is very very yellow the cool tones pull yellow as well if you can find a shade though it is amazing it looks gorgeous on the skin but I digress today it is about these $11 palettes they've got their new nine pan ones that have come up with that molten metal shade in the middle I haven't picked up one of them yet I do love these though as you can tell I have all five so we have a pink tone from Hawaii with love. Three mattes, two shimmers. Um, this is a beautiful rosy colour. Then we go to a more neutral colour palette with New York Minute. This is Cool Tone Neutral. She's beautiful. I like all of these. I've not been unhappy with any single one of the looks I have created. If you are a bit more adventurous, you like blues, these look great on brown eyes. If you have chocolatey brown eyes, my friend, these will look stunning on you. Ocean Drive. Oh, you can create a fair bit of depth there. This shimmer is fantastic. Then we are down to, we have a brown and green. This is Palm Springs. This is really warm tone. And then the one that we're going to use today, I wore this last week. This was the last one that I got. I'd had it sitting here for ages. I've had so many, um, I did a post on Instagram and so many people commenting on my eyeshadow. This is Welcome to Miami. These are gorgeous. We've got a real khaki colour, a really deep tealy colour. This is a just a beautiful, beautiful can't even think of what the shade of green it is at the moment then we've got a couple of neutrals so um this makeup I've just literally taken my eyeshadow off from another look that I have filmed today so um yeah this is this is actually coming up on Friday um this is a super cheap brand I am using all over my face at the moment um that video as I said it'll be up on Friday it's worth having a look talking a bit about what's going on in my life at the moment it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot for us not for me for my poor husband I've prepped my eyes as per usual with the MAC paint pot in painterly going in first up now this is a Chi Chi brush uh, I think it's a crease brush I have worn it off going into the lightest matte shade now tucking it straight looking straight ahead into the mirror and coming straight out at an angle see that's my brush is straight above the crease above the hood above your eye socket is where we are working with as you can see this is just a really light neutral shade you could do a one and done with this to be quite honest I, it's not me to do that but can I tell you I would leave the house with just this little bit on quite happily people that knew me would wonder what's wrong with me 
that. I'm going in a little bit. I think this is more a brush thing than it is the eyeshadow, to be quite honest. Let's just windshield wipe emotions. Let's get serious about it now. Really liking that build up. See, you could do one and done with that right there. Okay, so in the outer corner now, I'm going in with this khaki shade. Tap that off and just pack that on the outer corner. Same on this side. If you've coated both sides, you don't have to dip back in. And now anyone watching this, can you recommend a good a good um, lifting supportive non underwire bra? I have got I wear oh, I'm a big busted girl. I'm wearing underwire bras and I'm having all sorts of issues in that I keep getting this is a real oversharing probably an ick moment for you all i keep getting rashes underneath my breasts um being that i'm older and they are sagging and i keep using i've been using for months now cortisone cream on them the doctor took one look and said it's a fungal infection it goes away i have boiled my bras to try and kill it but what happens is where my underwire rubs underneath my breast, it's splitting my skin. It is painful. I am putting like cotton rounds underneath to try and um, stop the pain. Because, oh my God. But then what happens is it can split and weep and it adheres to my skin. It's just vicious. It's not nice. <laughs> so if anyone knows of any good bras, that could help. Um, but yeah, I've been using um, cortisone cream and a and Dermaid under there, and it's just I'll get rid of it for a couple couple of days, and then it'll come back. And like they say, to use the cream for a week or two weeks. I've been using it for months now, which can't be good. Okay, so really happy as you can see that blended super super easily, like that's blended beautifully. Going in with this sea foam green uh, green now they've got names why am i naming them oh because they're stupid names um i never know which way they should go if they're matching i'd say that that's lucky palms mermaid avenue teeny bikini bird of paradise and Cabana Crew. I'd name them like a man would name them. Green. Green. Seafone Green. No, look, probably wouldn't. I'd probably create themed colours as well. So going in with this now, such a beautiful shade. I really like this. This is an easy look to create too. Uh, even that, you could just leave that as that. You could go back in over the lid with this light neutral if you wanted to keep it all matte. Like, I love this little palette. These are $11. I mean, Makeup Revolutions palettes are that price. I mean, look at that. Isn't that pretty? That's pretty, pretty, pretty. Going pretty. in with the Charlotte Tilbury Liner Duo. And you could, you've got your choice with this because this has got the deep tealy green, which is what I'm using. But it's also got, look at that, that would work with this as well. So just going into the waterline with that for now. Because as we know, if I've got a five tan palette, I'm going to use all five shades. Despite the fact that I said you could get away with a one and done, with a two and done. Because I like to put all the colours on my eyes. So going in with this dark green now, this is a gorgeous shade. 
Now I have hazel eyes. I always used to say that they were poo brown. But they're actually hazel. They're the same shade as my grandmother's. These colours are great for it. Now I'm not going to... Actually, yeah, I will. I was going to say I'm not going to. I'm going to go into that lightest matte. Tap it off and use that just underneath as we blend this out. My house is crazy because I don't know if you can hear Simba meowing. I've got I've got a sliding door behind here. It's a like a glass sliding door. It's so that I'm facing the natural light. And my crazy cat is out there doing he's a, he's an orange cat, so today is his day of one brain cell. If you know, you know the craziness of orange cats. And he's just doing a out at the window trying to get my attention for me to open the door. And if I open the door, he will just roll around on the landing out there expecting me to pick him up. So I'm just ignoring him. So we've just used that to blend out. Now we're just going to go into the shimmer in the center there. And just tuck that in our inner corner for our highlighter bring that up a little bit just in this area where we tend to sink in here as we age so you can either just tuck it there like that I like to bring it up because what that'll do is get rid of this shadow and get rid of the depth and we'll flatten that out a bit you can see straight away that's done that I hope you can see. It's that simple. I'm just going to add a little bit more mascara because I probably wiped some of it off. So let's have a look. This is it. I mean, $11. $11 for five eyeshadows. $2.20 a shade. Let's be honest, you can't do much better than that. So this was the Welcome to Miami. I love these colours. These are greens. Greens are my jam in particular. Um, other than neutral palettes, I do love a lot of colourful palettes, but I really gravitate towards anything with green in it. Um, what are we looking at? What did I say? We've got five. $55. For, what is it 5 10 20 25 eyeshadows um, or just $11 for one they're beautiful I really like them um, I literally had people talking to me asking what I was wearing um, I had probably more comments on this eyeshadow than I did any others in a long time on Instagram so that is it if there is a eyeshadow palette that you are interested in me creating an eye look from um, or a color story that you're interested in please let me know down in the comments I'd really love to hear from you happy to um, do what you would like to see um, if I can if I can but until next time my friends don't forget to tell your mum to your sister to your friends to come along and subscribe to my channel ring the notification bell join this little family bye